What we're gonna be doing is installing a do-it-yourself kit for a S-Tech door edge guard. It's supplied in half inch by 196 inch roll, plenty to do all your cars. Go ahead and just roughly measure how much material you need. With a pair of scissors, go ahead and cut your product. When it bends, it'll release the cover liner. Once it's released, you come over to your vehicle at your local pharmacy or grocery store. You can get 70% isopropyl rubbing alcohol. Use this with any cloth of your choice to aggressively clean the back side of the door, especially an area which has points. Once you found the edge of your film, release about eight inches. Apply it to your starting point and run your thumb down. As you get to a point, pull so that the material wants to go around the point. As you come to a bend, move your lower hand to accommodate the curvature. Sliding your hand down and keeping even pressure. Once you get to your eight inches that was released, maybe 12, pull another section. Holding tension along your installation. If you find that you have a white line from where you stopped, you can easily lift the product to reposition and start pushing again. And as you see, the line will go away. So this is a product that can easily be repositioned. Once you get closer to the bottom, you can remove all your product, trying not to have it stick to yourself. Just lean it in your hand, holding tension and pushing with your thumb against your forefinger that's along the back side of the door. When you come to a stopping point where you're no longer going to hit a curb or door post wall as it opens, this is your area you need to protect. Where you want to terminate it, go ahead, just trim it with a pair of scissors, come back and push it down. The correct area to start wrapping a door edge is going to be at a point where it's turning or there's a point. Go ahead and push it around the back. It easily folds. Where you have a finger behind the back of the door, make sure to press firmly and distribute evenly. Run your finger along the edge of the door all the way down without wrapping. This will ensure no air is trapped. Come back up in the same direction. Then you can use your pincers and run up and down to complete the wrap, close the door, and move on.